morning friends welcome to shekham team market roundup firstly on the global markets yesterday when we closed most of the european markets were trading in red bearing for footsie whereas the american index futures were showing a flat to positive opening for the american markets but by the end of the day finally the european markets closed down by around uh, half to 1% across the board again bearing footsie and the american markets were up anywhere from 1 to 1.2% across the board with Dow Jones gaining 168 points and uh, S&P being up by 1.1 percent and uh, Nasdaq being up by around 1 percent. Coming back to our markets, we saw some volatility happening in our markets yesterday with Nifty at one point of time being up around 30-35 points. From there, going to almost ground zero and again finally managing to close above by, up by around 20 points. FIs in yesterday's markets were uh, seller by 107 crore rupees in cash market whereas they were buyer by around 293 crore rupees in uh, index futures. Domestic institutional investors were also buy in a cash market segment yesterday. Now let's have an update on derivatives. Good morning friends, I will give analysis on derivatives. Uh, yesterday taking mixed cues from the international markets, our markets also opened on a flattish uh, to positive note and thereon uh, it remained in the range uh, throughout the day as it oscillated between negative and uh, uh, positive territory uh, throughout the day and most part of the day in fact. And 8,000 uh, levels was acting as a crucial resistance for our market uh, where Nifty was not able to go above 8,000 uh, odd levels and eventually it managed to give a closing uh, just uh, with a gain of 0.10 percentage at 7987.75. It's like Nifty has been consolidating at this level at around 7950s and 8,000 odd levels uh, before showing some kind of an uh, uh, upside move. On the open interest terms, uh, we have seen two percentage addition in open interest that is around uh, three and a half lakh shares were added in open interest. Cost of carry uh, did uh, decrease a bit from 6.65 percentage to 5.02 odd percentage and his nifty premium did came down significantly from 45 odd points to 32 points currently while uh, put call ratio have also uh, uh, have also decreased significantly in yesterday's trade from 0.91 levels to 0.87 that is around 4 basis point a decrease in put call ratio was observed indicating good amount of build up was seen in call option while put option have seen very minor to minute addition in yesterday's trading session while volatility index uh, cooled off further after seeing after a status quo policy uh, status quo RBI policy uh, we have seen volatility index cooling off further by around uh, was down by around 5 odd percentage from 16.43 to 15.64 odd levels now on the options activity uh, due to rise in put call, uh, due to uh, decrease in put call ratio we have seen significant amount of build up in uh, call option uh, whether been and at the mini 8000 call option have seen an addition of around 12 to 13 odd percentage while 8100 and 300 call option have seen an uh, addition of around 16 percentage respectively in yesterday's trade while in put option uh, we have seen very minor uh, addition uh, from 7800 to 8000 uh, put option we have seen an addition of around 2 percentage only in yesterday's trading session However, 8,000 put option still remains as the second highest in terms of open interest while in call option uh, it's, it's a very uh, close call between uh, 8,000 uh, strike price and 8,300 strike price. Uh, both are equally, uh, both have equal amount of uh, open interest and uh, however uh, 8,300 call option uh, remains as the highest in terms of open interest but 8,000 uh, call option have also uh, have a similar kind of an open interest uh, with it. So, on and on studying the options activity and uh, also uh, studying the uh, open uh, futures open interest we feel uh, since nifty in today's trading session uh, can uh, ha uh, uh, is been pointing out to open above 8000 levels but the activity in 8000 call option still remains as a crucial we have been seeing a constant addition in 8000 call option which is not a positive uh, which is a, not a positive sign it's been a negative sign for our market so watch out for the activity in 8000 call option in today's trading session also if it's not been able to sustain 8000 call option then we might see a bit uh, selling pressure well uh, it would be more of a consolidating rather than uh, seeing a nose dive uh, kind of an uh, activity in today's trading session there are no securities in bank period for today's trade on FIS terms in index futures uh, they have been uh, net sellers in yesterday's trade uh, they have been net sellers by 323 odd crores and uh, the open interest of FIS in index futures it went up by around 6 percentage which was quite huge indicating some kind of a short positions which was been built by FIS in yesterday's trading session in index options they were net buyers by 1300 crores while stock futures net sellers by 200 or 204 crores and stock options net buyers by 11 crores only on the market level of five days we have stands at 7925 with a lower range at 7900 
and high range at 8100 s6 nifty is trading uh, positive as suggested it's, a, it's up by 16 points and expected uh, and it's been uh, it's been quoting at around 8001 and it's expected that uh, we might open on a positive note around 8000 or levels and 8000 is a crucial resistance and uh, we have to closely watch on 8000 levels in in today's trading session that's it from derivatives thank you now let's have a look at some of our trading ideas and some important news for the day. The first idea is Wukhar. Uh, European medical uh, regulator MHRA has issued unrestricted good manufacturing practices or GMP certificate to Sikaldana plant. Wukhar produces the metropol, uh, XR drugs used for treating blood pressure from this plant. Action to be taken here is long Wukhar with the stop at 1657 for a target of 1741 and 1775. Sun Pharma uh, has got US FDA not for uh, residronide sodium. The drug is used to treat osteoporosis. Action to be taken in Sun Pharma is long Sun Pharma with a stop at 716 for a target of 753 and 767. ILFS Engineering has backed 675 crore rupees order uh, for road construction in, in Bihar. The project involves engineering, procurement and construction with a completion period of 36 months. Action to be taken here is long RFS engineering with a stop at 58.8 for a target of 61.8 and 63. Reliance ONGC, American consumer DNM had uh, submitted RR ONGC gas uh, theft report to Petroleum Ministry indicating 11 to 12 units of gas explored by RIL from ONGC's fields. Gas worth upward of rupees 11,000 or uh, crore explored by Reliance from ONGC's side of KG field. Action to be taken here is law, short reliance industries with a stop at 984.3 for a target of 936 and 916. And action to be taken in, law, uh, in ONGC is long ONGC with a stop at uh, 231 for a target of 243 and 247. Delta Corp has uh, got license for a casino at its uh, hotel Deltin Suits in Goa. Action to be taken is uh, long delta pop with a stop at 86.7 for a target of 91 and 93. So important news flow for the day. Cox and King has sold its adventure tour business in uh, Britain for 25.8 million pounds that is uh, close to 260 crore rupees as a part of debt reduction uh, measure. RBI has uh, given notification that FIs and R RBIs can uh, now invest up to 26% in TV today network. PEs has completed due diligence of uh, RIL Infratel, Reliance Infratel, Reliance Communication may conclude deal this week valuing Reliance Infra at Rs. Uh, 21,800 crore rupees. Analysts said that NIMs of banks could fall by around 10 to 30 basis points as they adjusted to a new interest rate regime. As for government sources, pharma department is reworking a bulk drug policy. Government is looking at PPP model for bulk drug sector. Dr. Reddy uh, likely to transfer oral products out of uh, Bachupalli facility. New filings of oral sites, solids likely from uh, Vizag and Shikakulam plant. HDFC Bank has in invoked a pledge on 1,50,000 units of United, United Spirits uh, shares. Creditors of IBRCL Limited have adjust, decided to convert their 7,500 crore rupees of loan into majority, uh, majority equity holding. Maharashtra government has decided to scrap the tender awarded to Reliance Infra for construction of link over the sea from Worli to Hajali, uh, which was worth rupees 5,000 crore rupees. Hero Motor uh, Corp has reported sales number. Sales number up at 5.5 lakh uh, units. Tata Motors total sales at 38,918 units versus 41,720 units, down 7% YOI. TVS Motor Company witnessed a 2.43% growth in sales to 2,25,000 units versus 2,20,000 uh, units. Stocks with positive bias are Ultratex uh, Cement, Oil India and Havens. Stocks with negative bias are IBGL, Adani Port and Axis Bank. Stocks for investment are Aditya Birla, Nuo, Axis Bank, Britannia Industries, MLM and Sun Pharma. That's all friends from our side. Thanks and bye bye. Nice training session.